Well, we all know The Chosen is going to end someday. It cannot continue for a thousand seasons. As much as it is hard to hear, Dallas Jenkins and the other contributors to The Chosen planned only seven seasons to tell the incredible story of Jesus' ministry. We're almost halfway there with the fourth season coming up, but maybe there is a better way to look at it than to feel somber about it. The end of the series can open the way for other stories to appear on the screen. It turns out Dallas Jenkins plans precisely that. A few weeks ago, Dallas Jenkins and two cast members from The Chosen were at the K-Love Fan Awards. The show's season three final was nominated for the Film and Television Impact Award. Not surprisingly, the team won and Dallas took the stage with Abe and George, who play Big James and John, respectively. Dallas made a long speech about the show and thanked everyone for their help and support. After the ceremony, there was a press room where many people asked the team questions. At one point, Dallas talked about planning other shows. He said there is a strong demand for stories from the Bible and that they have a lot of stories to tell. He actually plans to do another project after The Chosen is over. This could be possible thanks to The Chosen soundstage and set located in Texas, which The Chosen team created on their own. Dallas said they and perhaps others who want to tell Bible stories could use this set to continue making these types of shows. Honestly, the success and impact of The Chosen are not just for one time. The series acquired so many fans worldwide that I feel like any other project made by the same team would be pretty successful as well. The Chosen showed that a biblical show about the ministry of Jesus could be almost perfectly biblically accurate and mainstream simultaneously. But there's also this to consider. The series has found itself surrounded by major controversies. First, there was the fear of the show becoming a product of Hollywood. This happened because Lionsgate acquired the rights to distribute The Chosen's episodes. Then there was the whole issue about the pride flag, which caused a lot of people to stop watching the show because they believed a pride flag did not have any place on the set of a Christian show. Some even thought we would see the pride flag in one of the episodes of The Chosen Season 4, which is absurd. Everything appears calmer now, but there is also the truth about all those people leaving the fandom. I wonder if the number of people who stopped being fans will impact the viewership numbers of Season 4 and the rest. I guess we will see that in a few months. I also wonder what projects Dallas could develop once The Chosen is over. A series or a movie about the life of Jesus before he called on his disciples. They would have to use de-aging technology to make Jonathan appear younger, or he could leave the throne to a younger actor, even though I'm not ready for that thought yet. No matter the subject, I think Dallas and his team would do a great job, and I'm sure the fans would follow. What do you think? Would you watch other TV shows or movies made by Dallas Jenkins? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to next season for more videos like this. See you soon.